Today is Friday, May 3rd, and this is Tommy Media's News in 90. I'm Kevin Struess. China on Friday launched a lunar probe to land on the far side of the moon and return with samples that could provide insights into differences between the less explored region and the better known near side. It is the latest advance in China's increasingly sophisticated space exploration program, which is now competing with the U.S., still the leader in space. Arizona Governor Katie Hobbs is signing of the repeal of a Civil War era ban on nearly all abortions was a stirring occasion for the women working to ensure that the 19th century law remains in the past. St. Thomas President Robert Vischer sent an email to all students Thursday morning addressing the protests on college campuses surrounding the Israel-Hamas war. The email was sent after a pro-Palestine protest spread across college campuses nationwide, calling for universities to divest from Israel and cease study abroad programs in the country. For more, for more visit TommyMedia.com. And for TommyMedia.com, I'm Kevin Struess.